one of the best friends I've ever had in the world. I was best man at his wedding, you know, uh, we had, which was a good time. Uh, you know, we did the truck thing there. Um, we all took all, all, the, all the groomsmen, the groom and the groomsmen, we all had trucks. And so that's what we took from the church to the reception and back and forth and, and, and paraded that way. So, you know, it's always been a truck thing with, with Eric. He worked that truck. That truck drove and, you know, you get bumps and bruises every day out on the road and, and to keep them up and it's, it's a full-time job on a full-time job. You drive and then you work all weekend and try and find time to go do the play and still take care of a family and, and he did it. He, he did her well. He was just, just that special guy. He's one of those guys that, uh, very hard working for starters and then, and then very dedicated to his family. Now he's kind of a legend. Um, he's uh, kind of a big name in the show circuit, and he, uh, yeah, tr trucking was that dude's life. I mean, if you needed anything cool or wanted a cool idea, he was the guy to talk to, and he could help you get it done. He's just a super nice guy. I mean, uh, I think anybody that knew him got along with him great. You know, he just he was just just a, a great guy, hard worker. He had uh, lymphoma, and he was diagnosed, uh, oh, God, when was it? It was just after the truck show last year, so he, it, it's very aggressive, and he fought really hard till right up to the end, and it was just, there's nothing more we could do. You know, this year was our 12th year for our truck show, and uh, we decided this year, as a tribute to Eric, uh, we were going to do something a little bit different. His wife asked us if we could do a convoy uh, for Eric. It was one of the things, they, it's kind of a thing they do at some of the larger truck shows. And she said that was one of his most favorite things to do was, was to partake in the, in the convoys. And I, we talked and I said, yeah, I think it's something we could probably squeeze in. And I drove Eric's truck. Uh, his wife and his two girls rode along with me and we led the convoy and we had almost 50 went on with us and uh, so we convoyed from there the 40 miles to Beatty and it was spectacular. From where we, the starting point all the way to Beatty, there were people along the roads up on the sides, whether they were videotaping or just sitting there watching the convoy or just uh, several people had big banners they held up, you know, in support of it. and. Uh, I tell you what, it, it was an emotional day, and every time I've seen a big crowd and they're all standing there waving for Eric, I just, you know, I just, I about want to cry, but you know, I, I, I just, I just, very proud to do that for him. Just to look in the mirror, or look out the back window of the truck, uh, to see that extremely long line of trucks that never ended was just awesome. just this the trucking community is we're very close-knit and uh, they just everybody said it was just one of the best experiences they've had and uh, the camaraderie and the the sights that you'd see coming down a hill and you just see nothing but trucks in front of you and nothing but trucks behind you and they just said it was just pretty unbelievable a good send off for Eric that day. Eric's wife Lisa was in full support of us doing this. She thought that would be just completely 
awesome to do, and, and, and she loved it. Her kids loved it, and you know, all of her family came out and was in a group, watched us come to town. All, all of Eric's family, same thing. They all come to watch us come to town, and it's just, they were all very pleased with what we did. Um, they are very excited for how the turnout was. And uh, by the way things turned out, I think it was a real success. To, for, and, and it was a nice tribute for Eric. I'm very sorry to, to everyone in Eric's family for, for their loss. You know, I lost one of the best friends I ever had. They definitely lost, a, you know, Lisa lost a great husband. They lost a great son, a dad, you know. Uh, I'm, so I, I just want to say I'm very sorry for their loss, you know, and, and uh, you know, since his passing, um, Lisa's been, I've been working with Lisa. We've, we've, this will be the third truck show that I've taken his truck to and, and, and that people have wanted his truck to be at. Um, and she was more than happy to let it go. So I, I, I took and drove it, whether I drove it or hauled it to a show for her. Um, I got to do that and, and, and I'm more than honored and, and I'm very happy she let me do that. Um, so it, it, once again, it's just, it was, it was an honor. Just uh, our thoughts and prayers are with you guys and, and we're thinking of you.